Hello. Ah. Hello, everyone. I am Xenogellion. I am really thirsty, and I am very practically doing this while recording streaming, technically, to YouTube. Ha <laughs> So this is a little vlog. Uh, I've not done a vlog in a while. I did actually record one a couple of weeks ago. Sorry for the noise. But it was crap, and I'm like, nah, I'm going to do better. So um, Loz pointed out to me that I haven't done a vlog in a while and I technically really need to do one or I'm gonna make a mess before the big thing happens which I'm about to tell you All right yeah so I've been dark for a little while uh, the last thing I released I'm pretty sure was at 10 o'clock I've not done any Arbiter's assessments. It's not because I'm bored. It's not because I have no idea of what to do next. It's, no, I, it's not that I haven't got anyone to help. It's just a simple case of, I'm fucking moving. I'm doing something that I really loathe doing. And I didn't actually have much of a choice to do. As you can see behind me, all the shit that, like, all the books and everything has actually, they've all gone because uh, they're all packed away and everything. So over the next 72 hours, I am moving all my shit. Fuck my life. Right, so that's the big thing. That's the big news. So for the next week or so, I'm still going to be quiet. I'm not going to have a proper internet connection. I'm going to try and piggyback off my phone to see if I can actually use my mobile data on my PC, but it means that I won't be able to actually update any games or anything like that. And unfortunately, it means I'm not going to be able to play the Planes of Eidolon until after I get a proper internet connection, or I somehow manage to bodge something, like maybe I download it at my parents' while I'm down that weekend, or what the fuck ever. Maybe I could go visit a friend and download it. Right, so, another point. There's going to be no 10 o'clock this coming week. So typically 10 o'clock comes out on a Monday. So Monday the 9th of October, there won't be one. This will be the second episode, or well, this is the second week we will have missed in four years. Right? This isn't intentional. It's just a lot of hassle to try and find time to record an episode. <coughs> find time to record an episode and get it all done and everything when really I should be packing. I've still got a lot of crap that I need to deal with. That stuff is actually going to go, uh, well, most of that stuff is going to go to charity, but it's just like, I've just got so much shit to deal with, and I've got 72 hours really to deal with it. Um, another point, I'm dropping the dev stream rundowns. So I did a few of these. People might wonder where they've gone. In all honesty, I doubt any of you really care. There are content creators out there like Quiet Shy that actually do a much better job at doing a dev stream breakdown abridged thing. And mine, were, though, were great and detailed, they weren't really funny and witty, and it just seemed like a lot of hassle to actually do. The other two assessments, however, I've exploded in popularity. And in all honesty, I'm very surprised. The quality of the work that comes out is high, they are fast to produce, and they actually get a good chuckle out of most people, and that's what they're aiming to do. So I was very surprised when the second one, which was about the Plains of Eidolon, exploded to have like 32,000 or 36,000 views when it was just like, holy shit. So Arbitus Assessments will be coming back if I can somehow wrangle getting the data working on my phone, what I might do is actually record some episodes, put them all together, then put them on a USB stick, which my keys are somewhere with my USB stick, and then take it to work and upload it. I can't promise anything. I'm not going to promise anything, so on and so forth. Tactical Terror League will be making a comeback as soon as I finished moving. So Tactical Terror League has been put on the back burner only because I'm having to sort out moving and shit like that. So that's really infuriating. But uh, it needed to be done. Xeno Codex will be making a comeback as well. So I really enjoy doing those. But they're actually very high demand of production in order to actually produce the content and they don't actually generate the traffic that the Arbiters does but I do intend to continue doing the, the Xeno Codex. There is actually one idea that Loz and I bashed around during one episode at 10 o'clock that I really want to flush out as a Codex but it's not had I've not had the time to fucking deal with it. The last thing, or oh, was the Xeno Codex the last thing? 
think it was Xenocodex, was actually the last thing. I apologize. So that's it for me, basically. I'm going to be going dark. I, you know, if you want to actually continue to support me and things while I'm dark, please feel free to actually share the Arbiter's videos with your friends and things because, you know, that they are actually extremely successful. I am trying to do more and I am actually trying to reach 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year. So I've got basically just under three months to get uh, just un so just over 2,000 subscribers. So I want to try and push for that. See how it goes. Um, all right, so that's it for this vlog. I hope you all have a lovely week and I hope that I managed to get the internet. Oh, hmm. Yeah, I'm going to briefly explain this. So, the move has been extremely stressful. I've not moved by my cho own choice. I'm being forced out of my apartment. Um, sorry, I was going to say goodbye. I'm really good at these. Uh, the property I'm moving into is nice, but I'm just going to say estate agents just flat out suck. All right? They are either overworked or they don't give a shit about their work. And... When I completed my background check three weeks ago, two or four weeks ago, I asked my estate agent, please, could I actually get permission to install a fiber internet connection to the property? Right? I, I need permission in order to do it because of the internet service provider doesn't actually have a cable running to the property. Anyway, so I asked and I asked and I asked and I asked and it's been three or four weeks and I finally got permission today i actually am legally living in the property at for like the last seven days and i've only just had permission today so hopefully hopefully i can get the internet back up by the 17th of october but there's no promises and it's very fucking stressful so i really fucking hope the mobile phone thing works anyway so that's it for this vlog thank you very much for listening if you want to actually help my channel blah 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 do the thing that everyone else says i can't be bothered and i will see you on the other side of all this shit and i'll talk to you soon